In this session, we will calculate the components in series. After this video, you will know how to calculate the components in series, change your preferences for the calculation, learn how to modify piping requirements. We need to specify which line and system we want to calculate. Let us choose pump regulating system. Then we look into wet return line. The first thing we need to do is to specify the operating conditions. Let's look at 150 kilowatts, then minus 10, temperature 30 degrees Celsius, and a circulating rate of 3, and we have connection DIN-EN butt weld. The program suggests DIN-EN 65, which will give us a velocity of 12.55 meters per second, and then we can start with a pipe system. Various types of pipe elements are shown here, and the first thing that we see is that we have a steel pipe according to the DIN-EN and according to the ANSI connection. What we can do is to go to Options, Preferences, and select Edit Preferences and Components. We can see here that both Steel DIN Butt Weld and ANSI are chosen. Let's deselect ANSI. It has changed now. As we have now changed our preferences, and now we only have the DIN pipes. Let us start with a piece of pipe. The program offers 10 meters, but this is not what we need. Let's reduce it to 5 meters. It is a horizontal piece of pipe, and we want it to be 45 degrees. We go to add a 45 degrees bend and 90 degrees bend pipe, and then we can see the velocity that fits together and that the result is okay. As the next step, we can add other valves. We can start with the stop valves. Should it be an angle or should it be straight? Let's take the angle one. We could take the solenoid valve, and here there are different possibilities when we move our cursor down. We can see the type of the product and picture related to it. Let's take ICS plus EVM, and we could get our filter and put a piece of pipe. In this case, steel pipe. We can use a reducer, in this case, the steel pipe, and an expander. Complete system can be built this way, specifying as you need it. Just take this and move it. Then we go for DIN 65, and then we reduce it, and this piping that does not fit together, so you can see down here on the connection. Then reduce the size of 40. Once we are satisfied with a selection, a report can be generated, showing different elements, the lengths, the specifications, and pressure drop for the various parts. The report can be saved and printed for your reference. This completes the session on selection of components in series. Stay tuned for other tutorials on Cool Selector.